and that's the state's problem. It's to be re-educated. I thought you were interviewing me. Oh, we're having a discussion. Okay. It's not an interview, it's a discussion. It doesn't really seem like a discussion. It's more like a bullying. <laughs> Unless you're the one asking the question. You might find different opinions. I'm finding your opinion very interesting. Can we end it? Let's go. Do you have any questions for me? Because I'm good. I'll just Have a good day. That's great. I'm just going to get the death stare. Where are you from? I'm from Vancouver. First, all right? And I got the American accent, Korean accent. I got okay accent, got mixed, right? So these people come up to me, I look at me as a suspect. That's why I'm putting still in here, so people are going to accuse me of being a pervert, accuse me of being a criminal. I got four twelve police officers. Actually, this is the public park, and I came here. He tell me it depends on how I'm doing the filming. I want to say, so you tell me to get a lawyer. I'm like, What's going on? Like, I'm, I, and this isn't the first time it happened. It happened during a lot of time because I, I'm like working for this blogger. So I'm being dispatched here to film stuff. And then these people they automatically, like, if I'm walking here, I'm like the sword. I'm sword down, which sticks out. Sorry. 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 and systems of oppression. Got validate perpetuator, perpetuators, perpetrators. And all of it, yeah. And, and, and the oppressions, and, and uh, continue to inflict impressions. Thank you. Oppressions and trauma that continue to impact people of marginalized communities. Um, we're not the first group to start speaking about rape culture. This has been happening for decades. Particularly in marginalized communities. So here we are again, still speaking out. Thank you for being here. It's next to Kansas. After the election in 2011 in Toronto, Slutwalk has grown and been represented in over 200 communities of cities worldwide, with other people speaking out against rape culture and specifically the disproportionate amounts of marginalization and oppression, uh, or disproportionate, disproportionate amounts of marginalization to people of oppressed groups. Um, women, feminized people, queer and trans people, indigenous folks, and sexual sex workers. Um, so we want to keep these conversations going. We want to continue to hold space for allies and survivors and people from various experiences to build a reinforced community. Um, To unify, to unify, to be empowered, to share our frustrations, to share our grief, our, our experience, our trauma, our love, our support, and our strength. Um, today, today, we're going to share our fierceness, our voices, our tenacity, and any energy we have that we want to bring and that we want to take from this march. Um, first, I would like to introduce you to our ASL um, interpreters for today. We have Sylvia and And also, our host for today is Jess Below. And um, Jess is a stand up comedian, a writer, a feminist, an actor, a producer, and she is the co host of. The Crimson Wave, a podcast, and fun fact, in 2015, Jess was part of um, a campaign that successfully eliminated tax from menstruation products. In
So stay with me, all right? This is all key information everybody needs. Okay, so the march, directions, okay? Where we're headed. We're going north on Church, west on Bloor, south on Queens Park to the uh, Legislative Assembly Grounds, okay? Woo! Yeah! Assembly Grounds! Um, so we're going to arrive at Queens Park uh, around 6 o'clock, and that's when we're going to hear um, some speeches from some incredible people, uh, including Lena Peters. Everybody, yeah, hashtag SWTO2016. Please use it. Yes, on Instagram, on Twitter, on uh, Snapchat, on you on the spot? Facebook. Go ahead. People use hashtags on Facebook. I, uh, yeah, I love it. Does anyone search them? I, I never have. Okay, um, let people know. Okay, yes. Hey, 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 get this. Okay, there's a root map handout. Melody, where are the root map handouts here? Okay, perfect. So everybody can grab one. Yeah, perfect. If you want one, you can see a marshal. And there's also contact info there if you want to uh, message anybody at Slotwalk, email address, etc. Et um, there's also an email sign up here as well. If you're interested in getting updates from Slotwalk, please sign up. Uh, volunteers will be going around with buckets throughout the rally, march, and speeches if folks feel inclined to help support. Slut Walk is a small grassroots gathering of uh, volunteers and they're not flush with financial resources. <laughs> I'm reading this off. Um, so, it, so this event and this event needs a little bit more community support to cover about uh, $150 in access of what they raise through uh, the funding campaign. So please donate if you can. Okay, marshals, marshals, where are my marshals? <laughs> Okay. Marshals are here to facilitate the demonstration. They're the eyes and ears of the march to ensure that all participants are safe, supported, and feeling good about demonstrating. Give it up for the marshals! Uh, their information facilitators between participants and organizers, and a buffer between demonstrators and traffic police hecklers and bystanders. Okay, super important. We also have some active listeners. Where are my active listeners? So we're going to get a by Pattern Bandanas here, okay? And uh, they're available during the March speeches. Here we go. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Bandana. Yeah, okay. Um, during the March speeches and for a short time after the rally, should anyone uh, feel triggered, need support, or want information about additional resources? Give it up for our active listeners! Okay, we're going to talk about accessibility. Very important. Everybody, please help us facilitate accessibility and inclusion, okay? There will be a scent-free section at the front of the march and at the front of the gathering at Queen's Park. We ask that participants at the head of the march and those closest to the speakers refrain from wearing scents and from smoking tobacco, herbal cigarettes, and marijuana, okay? Uh, so that chemically sensitive people can attend safely. If you want to smoke or wearing Sent, <laughs> sent. Um, please move further back, okay? Marshals at the lead of the march are available to discuss and plan for any mobility constraints or other accessibility considerations you would like us to be mindful of. Please feel welcome to help set the pace for the crowd by being closer to the front of the march. Oh, almost there, okay. Okay. If during the march anybody feels they are not able to continue walking, we have a couple spots in the lead vehicle to support folks getting to Queen's Park. Please speak to a marshal about this option should you need to. Uh, there will be access to some bottled water in case of emergency. Some marshals will be carrying backpacks with bottles and there will also be supply in the lead vehicle. 
PC and Marshall if you require hydration. And we encourage you to get some liquid before leaving Barbara Hall Park. <laughs> all right, accessible washrooms. They are located, we have wheelchair accessible in all gender washrooms at, yes, at the 519, our starting point. Also, Queens Park, uh, although access to it is at the discretion of the Queens Park Constable on duty. So keep that in mind. And there are a few businesses and public buildings that have accessible washrooms at Queens Park. Mount Sinai Hospital is one of them. 600 University Avenue, Southern College. And Tim Hortons! Get up with Tim Hortons! 70 George Street uh, West, I bet. Oh boy, posters, flyers, and chants. Oh my. Oh man. So, uh, we encourage everybody to grab a poster if you don't have one already. Please wave it proudly. And uh, see a marshal if you'd like a copy of the March Fruit, which I already mentioned, the March Fruit map. Or the chance that we will be calling out during the march, okay? Yeah? yeah. We're going to practice a couple of chants right now just to get in the mood. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Repeat after me, okay? Yes means yes and no means no. However, we dress wherever we go. Yes means yes and no means no. Wherever we dress, wherever we go. Nice, right. Here we go. This is a, 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 a number one. Two, four, six, eight. No more violence, no more hate. Two, four, six, eight. No more violence, no more hate. All right. This one's this is call and response. Okay. I say get it. You say we got it. I say good. <laughs> Sorry, consent. We get it. <laughs> I say consent. Get it. Not just get it. Generally. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. So you say we got it, and I say good. Okay. All right. Here we go. Consent. Get it! Got it! Good! <laughs> um, okay, these are the main ones. Got, whose bodies are bodies? Whose choice are choice? Whose bodies are bodies? Whose choice are choice? Okay, yeah, okay. Um, oh, this one's great. Okay, I shake my ass to smash the state, not to make you salivate! <laughs> Shake our asses as we yell this, please, okay? Here we go. Ready? Go for it. I shake my ass to smash the state, not to make you salivate! Okay, this last one is great. This is gonna get us really pumped up. Okay, it's kind of long though. Raise your voice, get on your feet, fight for our rights, fight for our streets. Did you get that? Yeah, yeah. Raise your voice, get on your feet, fight for our fights, fight for our streets. Okay, here we go. Go for it. Raise your voice. All right, everyone, the march is going to begin momentarily. Yep. <laughs> Looking for confirmation on that. Uh, so please start getting uh, into place to step up.